Hi, this is Scott here. I just want to go over a feature I added in 2021.24. It's called experimental, I call it experimental, but it's Lightarama import support. Um, the reason I'm kind of calling it experimental, uh, I got one user's layout and I went through and made all his models work, but there are still some other model types that I really haven't gotten um, definitions for. That maybe if someone else, other users could send me their layouts, I could look into importing them and make sure they import correctly. So, um, how the feature works in XLites, if you have a layout, in the layout screen here, you just right click and there will be an option now that says import lore S5 model and groups. And when you do this, it'll pop up a little warning saying this is kind of experimental, it's new. Um, if you have any issues where you import something that's way out of whack, contact one of us. So if you do import some models and they don't look correct to you, um, just uh, just send me a message on Facebook, um, and I'll look into try to fix that if possible. So once we hit OK, what it does in the background is it actually looks at all your um, layouts or previews in your S5 file if it's on that computer. And it lets you select one of your previews. Um, if you're on a computer that doesn't have S5 installed on it, it'll pop up with a dialog to let you select your layout XML file. Kind of what uh, Lightarama does in the background is it has this folder in your documents and this LOR previews. This is where all the previews are stored and when, that's what Xlights right now is looking for. And if it can't find that, then it just lets you manually select it. So. Um, so these are all the previews in, in your S5. And if you have S5 installed, you'll notice that this matches the same list over here in the previews. So, so if I select like base house here and hit OK, it'll go through. You might get some channel um, uh, warnings when it first does it. And you might have to fix these. But it'll go through and it'll find all the models in your S5 layout and attempt to import them into Xlites. In S5, if you have universes and start channel, universal start channel set up, it'll um, copy those over. So, in if I look in the layout, if you look at your layout in S5, if you have like the DMX universe set up here. Um, that'll be imported into Xlites. Other things that'll be imported is if you have the shape set, the transparency, and the space, or your the shape of your like light set. So if you have it as square, it'll be imported as square. There are a bunch in here that we don't support. So if you have one that's selected that's one we don't support, then it kind of just defaults to our circular blend one. But if you have different sizes set, those should all import as well. Um, things I haven't implemented, there is the background image. Um, I haven't added a way to import that yet. But yeah, if you look at any of these, this should match what's in um, S5. And as you can kind of tell, it does all the string channels. Like this had, uni this had individual uh, strings set up for the start universes. It imported all that. It also, it'll import, so if you have different string properties, so if you have like super strings, a single strand color, older style, it'll also import those as well. I don't remember how top of my head this has that type. Oh, so we have a single color white, so it imported that as well and made single channels. So um, the... The couple models that I don't really have many examples of is NS5. There's like a bulb model that I've never, I don't really understand what this does, but if someone has that in their layout, maybe they can send that to me. And the icicle model, it does import, but it's very, um, I think it still needs some work. So if people have some one icicle model, maybe some examples of that would be helpful as well. But um, and once these in, are inserted, you can just change them however you want in Xlites. So 
like default it uses the universal start channels from S5, but you can then convert these all over if you wanted to go to like auto start channel, auto layout type stuff. If you wanted to come through and delete models, but uh, it also does all the groups. Um, so it's just a kind of a quick way to import all your models so you don't have to do your layout from scratch from S5. So if you run into any issues or it doesn't import correctly, just uh, please let me know and I'll uh, try to look at it and make it a little bit better. So uh, yeah, thanks.